welcome back to the unboxers and today we have for you another Marvel Mini Mate Mini Monday <laughs> <laughs> this time we can see our characters and we have the Marvel Mini Mates from Luke Cage the Netflix series Woo -hoo! so uh, we recently finished up watching season 2 of Luke Cage yes and um, it, of course it's not appropriate for all ages but um, so check with that first but the mini mates are for ages 17 and up and I'm assuming that's because of the nature of the I show guess. yeah but they're um, they're collectibles and they have interchangeable parts too so we want to say a great big thank you to diamond select toys for sending these to us to share with you and so the four characters are you want to pick it up okay we have Luke Cage himself we have Cottonmouth um, and we have Misty Knight and we have Mariah Dillard. Woohoo! So, uh, we will try not to spoil, let's try not to spoil it just in case somebody has not finished or hasn't okay. seen it before and wants to check it out. So, um, let's take a look at the back. If you want to know about it and you don't want to watch it. Yes, it if you want to know about it, we <laughs> did do a video on our review of Luke Cage and so you can check it out. But basically he's a superhero that's, uh, bulletproof. All right, but right there. There we go. So uh, that's really cool. Shows you what they look like. Um, and it, you get, um, is this also Luke's? This is his past and present. Yes. So you uh, got this the hoodie up, hoodie like. down, and yeah. the retro. Cool. All right, so I think we're going to go ahead and get these mini mates out of the box and give you a closer look. We'll be right back. Hey, if you're enjoying this video, make sure you hit that subscribe button and hit that bell to get the notifications so you can see more awesome unboxer fun. Okay, and they're out of the box, and we will show you. I meant to read you this little um, bio thing. After a sabotage experience, experiment leaves him with super strength and unbreakable skin. Luke Cage becomes a fugitive trying to build his life in a modern day Harlem. New, Harlem, New York City. However, he is soon pulled out of the shadows and must fight a battle for the heart of the city, forcing him to confront a past he had tried to bury. So, uh, yeah, that's Luke Cage in a nutshell. I just love the unbreakable skin thing. I just think that is an awesome ability for I love the way they did the, um, the box, the way it makes it look like the from the show. Yeah, yeah, the, his yellow silhouette thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, very cool. All right, so um, let's start out with the man himself because he has two different versions and then he's going to pop the other pieces in to show you what the other one looks like. So here's, uh, oh look, that's hood down. Yeah. So here's Luke Cage, very cool, with his hood down. So that's cool. So you have this little piece that pops on in, in between his head and his shoulders. So that's if he's wearing his hood down. He has a hood up piece, but um, I'll show you in just a second. And each figure has I believe it's like 13 points of articulation could be 15 but anyway so they're articulated at the feet at the knees at the hips of course on both sides hands elbows shoulders um, neck and waist look yes, at that it's, so it's that's 14, 14. oh yeah. there's, a, there's two, six four, and six. six that's 12 and then 13, 14. Naked yeah. waist. Oh, okay. Maybe 14. Well, I was trying to give him one more. Anyway. <laughs> so there you go. There is Luke Cage. Very cool. So now you can, um, you, if you pop his head off, boop, which would never happen to the real Luke Cage. Uh, but anyway, and then you can put his hood on. So you put the, actually you put the head back on and slide the hood around it, I think. So here's the hood when it's hood up. Very cool. Uh-oh. He's like, uh, what are you doing to me, woman? You just slide the hood underneath that ledge. There we go. There he is. Cool. Very cool. And he has um, his older um, boxing version over there. And, of course, he comes with a stand. So they have a hole on the bottom of each foot. So you can down. pose them. Oh. It's upside down. So you can pose them and uh, on their stands. Very cool. All right, so go ahead. You can switch him out. This is the other um, body like that he a, comes with. So he yeah, comes like with a, hood down, and then he's got his like little old, retro like Power Man. Yeah. yeah. All right, so let's go villains now. This is Cottonmouth, and Cottonmouth, um, his whole jacket piece, if you would like, is to sli slips off, but it's solid green under there. 
and uh, he was a very interesting uh, character, or he, whatever, is a very interesting character yeah. um, in season one of Luke Cage. And uh, so he uh, definitely has an unusual name and a definitely a personality that you will remember. Check out his uh, his bow tie. I mean, not bow tie, his tie tie. And he was always well dressed. So, and he has the same uh, points of articulation, of course. Look at his face. Very cool. So there's Cottonmouth. Um, two guns came in the thing, so we just put one in each of their hands. Um, and so here is Mariah. So Mariah is, uh, well, in, anyway, she is the cousin of Cottonmouth. Yeah. And uh, look at her fancy blue shirt. I love that blue. And her hair is, like, slightly lighter in color. I really like that. They didn't just do everybody with black hair. Her hair is, is true to her color hair. And uh, she's got some brown boot things going on there, or fancy shoes. And uh, she's got the same points of articulation. I really like how they did her hair. And she is a very notable character yes. as well. So, um, and now we have Misty Knight, which uh, refuses to be called uh, Luke's sidekick. So here's Misty Knight. Here's her face sculpt, and uh, or her her you know how she looks because they're all shaped the same. Her hair comes off, and if you take her head off, you can remove her jacket, and she'll just have her you know she's a little more casual. Now she comes with an extra hand, which I went ahead and put it on her. You can see her regular hand over there, and I took it off and put this hand on where she's flashing her badge. Isn't that a cool detail? That's the great thing about Mini Mates. They just throw in those extra details that makes it so cool. And Mariah is awesome. And her character gets bigger and bigger as the, as the, the, seasons, and go, the seasons go on with Defenders and everything. So, spoiler alert, she, is, she shows up in others, um, the seasons of other Marvel heroes from Netflix as well, right? Yes. So... Let's see now. She is going to be she, in very cool Iron Fist season two as well. Yes, we just heard that. So spoiler. Um, all right, now we have Luke Cage, like the retro look for him. Does he when he has flashbacks? Yeah. He flashes back to this where he's got the silver headband, the silver wristbands. Uh, I think he might have a shirt in some of those, but yeah, it's kind of like his shirt. boxer type days. I mean, being a boxer, not wearing boxers. <laughs> well, it was from the um, yeah, like, when, like from him, him when he was in prison. Oh, okay, very cool. Oh, from when he fought in those. Yeah. yeah okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember that now. Very cool. A little bit of a spoiler, but anyway. but yeah, they kind of they kind of used that very with the cool. um, that was kind of his old look from from the comics um that they kind of threw in as a as a nod to the fans. Cool. All right, so um, I really like that one, but I prefer this Luke Cage. <laughs> oh, you're gonna you have to put his hands back on. So their um, shoes or feet do come off as well. And then when you're ready for him to be this one, you just pop his hands right back in. I believe he has the same hands, mm, maybe not as um, Misty Knight. Not sure. Maybe not the same paint color. Very cool. So there's Luke Cage standing beside himself. He's just beside himself with rage. <laughs> And I keep making him fall over. He does have a stand. It's in my hand. <laughs> so, all right. So there we go. There are the mini mates from Luke Cage. I think they look awesome. And um, there's new characters that we would love to see in season two. Yes. And most importantly, I would like my favorite villain, Shades. Yeah, what, that would be cool. Shades needs a mini mate. Do you hear that, Diamond Select? Shades <laughs> needs a mini mate. So I would love to see one of Shades and the other villains, um, Diamondback, mm -hmm. um, as well as some of the other villains um, in Season 2. I don't want to say anything because it might just spoil it. But anyway, so thank you so much for watching. We want to say another great big thank you to Diamond Select for sending these to us to share with you. They are super cool. We love our mini-mates. Thank you so much for watching. Comment, like, subscribe, tell a friend, and we will see you next time. Sweet Christmas.